Hey guys, my name is Chris and welcome back to Haywood Homestead. Today is Friday, July 29th and we're going to be stuffing our envelopes um, for the last time this month. This is the third stuffing. Uh, I do three a month, one in the beginning, one mid-month, and then one at the end of the month. So I've already gotten my money out of the bank and I've gotten written out what I plan on putting into each of our sinking funds. And so let me go ahead and take the money out and we'll count it. And as you can see, um, for today, we plan on adding 225 into our funds. So, all right, <clears throat> put this over to the side. Hope all of you are doing okay. My allergies have been acting up for the past few weeks and I'm trying to shake all of that off and get back to feeling um, better again. My ears have been clogged up and it's just been kind of irritating the past several days, but um, I apologize. I haven't gotten this video up a little earlier. All right, so we have 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 160, 170, 180, 190, 200, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. So $225 is what we have for today. All right, I'm gonna put this to the side. I'm not sure if you'll be able to see this, but I will separate this now that I have a, just a tad more room to do so. Let's see, we'll do like this, and then our fives down here. All right, so our first um, envelope we're going to stuff is actually uh, for my wife. It's not really a sinking fund, but I give her money uh, throughout each month so that she has cash on her. And so as you can see, her envelope is empty, and she, whenever... I uh, budget her money, I give it to her after I do the video, and then she takes it and does with it with uh, what she needs. So <clears throat> today, we're gonna be doing $30 for her. So I'm gonna do a 20 and a 10. I'm off from work today. Um, hopefully you'll see this today. If not, it may be Saturday. My internet connection is not so great here. All right, so there's 30. All right, moving on. <clears throat> Our first sinking fund is vacation. So as of 714, we made a deposit of $100, which gave us 200. Today, we're going to be adding $125 to this. So there's seven. 29 deposit and then 125 should give us 325 all right so here is our vacation money and let's add 125 so let's do 50 70 90, 110, 120, and 125. All right. <clears throat> so we have 100, 200, 250, 270, 290, 310, 320, and 325. We are saving uh, right now spending money for a cruise that we plan on taking at the end of September. Um, we are building a home right now for those of you who are new to my channel um, and the projected build was supposed to be the end or completion of the build was supposed to be the end of August but we just learned today that's probably not going to be likely it will probably be more so the end of September which is when our cruise will be so I'm not really sure yet if we'll be able to take our cruise or we might end up having to postpone it but we're gonna play that by ear and see how things go as we get closer to that, um, the end of September to see uh, what we need to do. All right, so pet health is next. 
Um, today we're going to be adding $20. And so as of the 16th, we had Toby and Amelia groomed. That was 120, which left us a balance of 545. Uh, next Wednesday, they are getting their shots, as well as a health checkup and new uh, flea and tick and heartworm medications. So we will be taking another deposit, or excuse me, withdrawal from this envelope then. Uh, we'll go ahead and update this. Deposit. And today we're doing $20. So that will give us 565. Okay. So there's 20. And we'll put that in the stack. Alright, so we have 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 250, 270, 290, 310. 330, 350, 370, 390, 410, 430, 450, 470, 490, 490, 510, 530, 550, 560, and 565. We have um, two cats and two miniature schnauzers, and so we and like putting money aside each month for expenses relating to their health because you just never know having pets when they'll need uh, vet check checkups, uh, medications, or if they get sick and that kind of thing. So if you have pets, I suggest you uh, maybe start like a little sinking fund aside for them. And even if you just add maybe $5 a week or $10 a month or whatever you can do, over time it will build and it will help um, lessen the blow of any major expense that might come up later. All right, so let's see. Next is gifts. All right, so uh, today for gifts, we're adding $10. We currently have 20, 40, 45, 50 in here. And so today will give us 60 and our goal for this envelope is to put $100 um, in, and then at that point, when we take from it, we'll just keep getting it back to $100. So that's where we're going to cap this off at. So let me fix this. All right, so plus $10 will give us 60 and deposit. 729. Alright, so here's 10. So we have 20, 40, 50, 55, 60. Alright, next we have is uh, money we're putting aside to put toward our mortgage principal later in the year. Um, as of last stuffing on the 14th, we put a, uh, a deposit of $30 in, which gave us $1,060. Today, we're going to be adding 15. So plus 15 should give us $1,075. Deposit $729. All right, so we'll take a 10 and a 5, and we'll take our money out of our envelope here so we can count it together. I, I said I had more room, but I am working in a small space. I can't wait to, when we get moved in our house one day, I'll, I'm going to have like a really big table dedicated to my video so that I can spread out a little bit but hopefully you're able to see everything I'm doing right now that that needs to be seen. Um, so there's 10 and a five. All right, so we have 
100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 800, 900, 950, 1,000, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, and 75. So $1,075. We don't have a goal for this right now. We're just trying to save as much as we can. And then um, in October, we plan on making a really big uh, sum of money, whatever we have built up at that time toward our mortgage or the principal part. <clears throat> All right, next um, and our last um, sinking fund that we have is car maintenance. So let's go ahead and update that. And for car maintenance today, we're going to add $25. So that should give us one eighty, I believe, and we're going to take, uh, let's see, 10, 15, 20, 25, and that'll be the rest of our money here. So, this is our newest sinking fund, it's building quite nicely. And we both, both my wife and I, have two older cars, so. As you know, as cars age, more things start to go wrong with them, and we just thought it was important to start a fund for repairs and whatnot, so. All right, let's count this and see what we have. So we have 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 140, 150, 160, 165, 170, 175, and 180. So 180 dollars. All right, this completes our cash envelope stuffing, guys, for the end of July as well as for the month. I hope all of you are uh, able to put aside some money um, or have been able to put aside some money this month, uh, whether it was a little bit or a lot. You know, gen we do have a general savings account in our bank, but we like to save what sinking funds are, we save specifically for different things, so. Well guys, I appreciate y'all watching today. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Welcome to all of my new subscribers. I have quite a few here lately uh, that have come from Glenda Sully's uh, YouTube channel. So I welcome all of you here. If you have any questions about how I budget or want any help budgeting, please let me know and I will be glad to assist you. So if you haven't already, please subscribe and also like the video. Uh, that will definitely help the channel grow. Thanks, guys, and y'all have a wonderful day.